book Where's Ronnie by Carmen Fogan, illustrated by Floyd Cooper. Rodney, where's Rodney? Once again, Rodney wasn't in his seat, and Miss Garcia had had enough, but Rodney had interesting things to do, like watch a big blackbird soar over the cafeteria that smelled like yesterday's lunch, or catch a tiny pill bug creeping across the windowsill. He stood on his tippy toes to find the stray dog that, bu that bullied the neighborhood. Rodney was inside, but he wanted to be outside. Outside was where Rodney always wanted to be. Miss Garcia let out a long, deep breath. She stepped behind Rodney and tapped him on the shoulder. Rodney joined the class. The word of the week is majestic. Miss Garcia said, majestic. Can you tell us what it means? Rodney looked around the classroom. There were a million eyes looking back. Nope. Miss Garcia took another deep breath. Rodney balanced on one foot like a pink flamingo. Sherling Su Lin giggled and covered her mouth. Then he ho hopped in the air like a cricket. Cotty chuckled. Then Rodney stretched out his arms like an eagle soaring high above the... Sit down, Rodney, Miss Garcia said. The whole class roared with laughter. Okay, majestic means grand and beautiful, Rodney. If you can't do your work, you won't be able to go on the field trip to the park on Friday. But Rodney didn't care. He knew all about the park. It was a small triangle-shaped patch of yellow grass next to the corner store and the bus stop. It had one large cardboard trash can and two benches where some grown grown-ups sat all day long. Yes, Rodney knew the park well. Anyway, Mama said to stay far away from the park. When the three o'clock bell rang, Rodney came outside. He darted across the street, past Miss Jackson, the crossing guard. Walk, she yelled, but he ran. He ran past the corner store. He ran past the bus stop. Then he ran past the triangle-shaped patch of the yellow grass and the two benches and the broken gate where the bully, the bully dog slept. Now he could see Mama peeping out the window. She opened the door and gave him a big hug. I'm glad you're inside, she said, but outside was where Rodney wanted to be. Very early on Friday, the old yellow bus squeaked, jerked, and rattled out of the school parking lot. Even before it reached the front get gate, Su Lin and Amina were, were singing and playing clapping games. Everyone was excited, but not Rodney, and he knew that when they got to the park, they would all see that he was right. Parks are no big deal. The bus turned a corner onto 2nd Street, but Ronnie thought that the bus driver must be lost because he drove past the bus stop, past the corner store, and even past the yellow grass. Su Lin and Amina kept singing and clapping. The old school bus rumbled, rolled, and cracked farther and longer, or creaked farther and longer than Ronnie had ever been. Ronnie gazed, Rodney gazed out the window. He stared at the white lines in the middle of the Great Highway. He counted the big trucks and passed the bus. He leaned to see the birds float above the fields of tall, dry grass. He watched the people in wide straw hats picking fruits and vegetables in neat rows. The old bus clunked and coughed and choked. It climbed higher and higher until a great mountain swallowed it whole. At the other end of the tunnel, the mountain slid out the old bus into a flash of sunshine. No one laughed, no one talked, and no one wiggled. Su Lin and Amina even stopped singing. Look, everyone, Miss Garcia announced, it's the park. And finally, Rodney was outside. At the park, at the park, he was higher. He was lower. He was bigger. He was smaller. He was louder. He was quieter. He was faster. He was slower. Rodney was outside, more outside he had ever been before. The sun sank in the sky. It was time to leave. Some of the children chattered and giggled. Some munched on leftovers, others dozed. Su Lin and Amina sang more songs. 
Where's Rodney? Miss Garcia asked. Rodney was sitting quietly, gazing out the window. Miss Garcia sat beside him. Do you like the park, Rodney? Oh, yes, he said softly. It's majestic.